Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is Netra Dev here and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to efficiently search for an accommodation which would be closer to your university or closer to your workplace. So this video is for you guys. So please do stay tuned until the end of videos because I'm going to give you a lot of important tips and tricks on how to efficiently land in a real good apartment so the number one in our list is how to search for an apartment so I'll be doing a screen share and I'll be telling you how you can efficiently do this uh, apartment search uh, number two is uh, you also have a couple of co-living or student hostel kind of places here in Lithuania especially in Vilnius so I will show you guys that as well and I will give you a couple of important information about what are the things to be considered before you uh, pay the money, you know, and book yourself an apartment and some really good tips and tricks. So stay tuned. I'm going to do a screen share and I'm going to show you how to do that. So the first thing is we have to find the address of our faculty. So I'm going to put Vilnius University, Vilnius University Faculty of Business and Economics. So that is my faculty. That is where I studied. And as you can see here, uh, there is a place called address and that's your address. But you don't, you know, you need to see how it is in the map, where it is located in Lithuania. So I'm just clicking on the maps here. So it opens up the Vilnius uh, map. And I'm going to zoom out. Okay, so this is Vilnius city map and my faculty is located here. So I know that, you know, I have to find an apartment somewhere in this particular area because that would be really the best location for me to take an apartment in so i know for a fact that okay this is where i need to find an apartment so i would say taking an apartment in zirmunai is amazing zirmunai is a really nice place to live i live personally in uh, zirmunai uh, there are a couple of malls so all these are malls like ozas acropolis panorama and there is like a calvario uh, turgus is nothing but a market so you get like really cheaper uh, vegetables and fruits you can go there and do a little bit of shopping so as i say solitikas is here and i'm going to search for an apartment in this locality somewhere here so that it's not too far not too far because this is also Vilnius and these area they are they, these areas have like pretty low cost accommodations available but imagine it would take you like almost one and a half hour to two hours in bus to reach your university then it makes no sense so our focus would be somewhere uh, within five to seven kilometers from the university that's the prime location so I'm going to go to orodas.lt. That is the main website that all of us use to find accommodation in uh, Lithuania. I'm going to translate the page. And here you see object type. So in the object type, I'm going to click apartment for rent. So you can either take house for rent if you have that kind of a budget, if you can afford that, because houses are pretty expensive here. I'm going to go for the apartments because that's more student uh, focused. So I'm going to click the municipality as Vilnius. So if your faculty, if your workplace is in Kaunas, please do click Kaunas. So in my case, I'm just going to click Vilnius. And then I'm going to put uh, a uh, maximum budget. So my maximum budget is, let's say, I don't want to be paying more than uh, 400 euros on an accommodation. So I'm just going to put like 400 I'm going to click search and now you see like you will find a list of uh, accommodation available even from the price of 250 so which is like you know even better but this 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 view of the page is not very user friendly because you have to like open every uh, advertisement and see 
where is this particular place and you have to like relate it with the um, uh, you have to relate it with your uh, um, university address so what is the best option here is you have an option called C on map so if you click on the C on map then all these addresses will be automatically populated and they will be shown in the wellness map like where exactly this particular place is so you'll have a pin there and you can search one more feature i wanted to tell you is this open house thing so whenever you see open house that means from this day that is august 28th you can come and see this um you know see this house do a little bit of uh, checking like you can go check out the place if you like it then you can sign the contract with the owner so the checking uh of the place can be done from 28th of august that's what open house means so let me go to the see on map button and now sorry <laughs> so now you see i'm just gonna go zoom in now I see that there are pretty much, uh, you know, there are pretty options available here. So Soliticus is here. So somewhere here is the location of my university. And I have like a couple of places which, which offers accommodations. So all you have to do is like spoof on top of these and then you will have all the information about the accommodations available. So out of this, I'm just going to click on one of this and i'm just gonna read about it so this is a 30 meter square apartment and the price is this number of rooms a tall is which floor is this located in and then number of floors is the total number of uh, floors in that particular building heating type and blah 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 here there will be all the information that is required and whatever uh, like the number of rooms heating advantages what are all the amenities available in the house and if there is any brokerage fee or not so all of these details will be written here so if you like scroll down then you will actually find uh, the own information so you can like call this person so as you see Simon is the real estate broker who has posted this ad so you can actually call to this person and that person would be able to um, would be able to answer uh, your queries and you can uh, fix um, a day and time and you can visit the place oh and one more important thing so if you scroll down here you can also see this criminal statistics so you can see like what crimes have happened in that area in the past uh, month so radius of crimes within 500 meters radius last month so this gives you like an estimation of whether this area is a safe zone or no or so depends so the next important thing is i would like to show you from my list is a search of the co-live apartment so in lithuania you have a couple of uh, co-live apartments so these are those it's called live-in like this is a student hostel or co-live however you want to call it these are pretty nice i have myself visited these places and they have a lot of amenities so for example if i click on the co-live they have like really good looking rooms and they have like gym they have all the facilities like washing machine some gaming area a place to sit and work or study tv zone and gym and whatnot so it's a pretty nice uh, option if you guys want to live here and they have like mentioned all the details of the rooms that are available like one room two rooms the price per room all those details will be mentioned you can also visit the official project project page like the official website of this uh, live-in wellness uh, here and you can like go there and contact that person and write them an email and they will they will answer you so one more thing i wanted to say is don't ever do any payment before you come to lithuania and check this place out okay so now how do i check whether if this particular place is near to my faculty if it has the required routes and everything to you know get to the faculty uh, to, um, every day so what i do is in this place you have like an option of how to get if you click there okay i'm not 
signed in because I'm using incognito. So if you click there, you will be taken directly to the uh, maps and not Zermanai city center, but I'm going to put like faculty of business. Oh, this is not VGTU, but faculty of of business and economics Vilnius University so if I put that you can see that it automatically shows me the best option available so if i'm taking the bus then these are the buses available so i have like a straight bus from here to here it, and i can reach there in 28 minutes and the buses are like every 12 minutes available so or you can find the detail of the buses here just the basic google search you also have an app called traffic Traffy app. Uh, you can also download this particular traffy.com and buy tickets in this and uh, travel. So this is more when once you come here. But you can also download this app to see if the uh, accommodation that you are booking is closer to your university or workplace. So this is also a nice option. One more important thing I wanted to tell you, which is from my list, is that please do not pay money to any 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 accommodation before you come see that place because there are a lot of scams happening these days and it is better to be safe than um, get into a situation where you lose all your money so please don't 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 ever do any payment from india if you uh, are india or any other part of the world please don't do any accommodation booking unless you come here and then see that place in person but okay if you want a very cheap and affordable but really good apartment for the first couple of days then i would suggest you booking it in airbnb so you go to airbnb and then you put wellness 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 you put wellness and i'm gonna give an approximate like i'm traveling on september 15 i would like to book it for a week number of guests would be one you can also bring in your pets you know airbnb can also show pet friendly uh so as you can see here i have a really nice place to live for 37 euros a night which is so beautiful this is more than enough you know for the first week and so i would suggest take some apartment that is like this and then stay there for a week or two or even for a month because this is pretty low cost and and this actually this price covers uh, utilities as well like water heating and etc but it depends from accommodation to accommodation so you need to check that with the airbnb host so also they have like this super host that means uh, people had a very lovely experience staying there in that airbnb so do something like that and uh, and and be mindful because you you don't want to lose your money so please 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 do not pay money from india for any accommodation don't book anything one more important thing i could show you is that we also have a couple of facebook groups i would i will add the names of the facebook groups down here in the description below and i would also show you that we also have a couple of real estate uh, websites um capital.lt it's here so these are all real estate websites uh, where you will have to pay the broker a commission like it would usually be like one month rent so that's a bit expensive but uh, you can also you know these are reliable uh, people so if you want to book apartments if you are not able to find that you know that apartment that you have in mind and you're not able to like get it then there are a couple of play real estate brokers that could help you so you have uh, capital.lt loris.lt uh you know loris.lt 
so um, so you have like an option sorry loris.lt so these guys you can also find like accommodation there but only thing is you have to pay them some commission broker commission so it could be a little bit painful but yes these are all good options so these are a couple of uh, ways that I personally uh, used to find an apartment and I hope these were helpful please don't forget to join uh, the Indians in Lithuania Facebook group uh, you have a lot of communication happening there also join foreigners in Vilnius uh, group or foreigners in Kaunas or whatever city you are going to because you have a lot of um, communication and updates and stuff so it's better to be a part of the community and yes pretty much everything uh, you're all set so i would say that's that's the best way to find yourself an apartment <laughs> so i hope you guys like the video please give me a thumbs up i'm trying to make a lot of videos uh in the upcoming days so i hope all of them would be helpful Please show your love by sharing and subscribing to my YouTube channel and pressing the bell icon there, you know, just so I, if, if uh, pressing the bell icon there, so every time I post a new video, you get a notification like, hey, Netra has posted a new video. <laughs> so yes, I would really um, appreciate if you could please subscribe and support my channel. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching my video and I'll see you in my next video soon. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love you all and see you next time.